some of these um, mostly the same, and then featuring the poem by um, Rio Trail. Rio Trail. And when I read the poem, the poem did give me chills. It's a beautiful poem. And I wanted to look like have the plane reflect the beauty of the poem of all the money through this plane. So my inspiration was to get the plane in the air and the poem. And then on each side I was going to, I'm going to do a rock wall because in Normandy they have a lot of rock walls. Actually, somewhere surrounding the airport where it landed on its 70th anniversary. And in the rock wall, I'm going to have um, to appear like their names are engraved in the rock the original crew from the plane from World War II and the crew that flew the plane for the 70th anniversary to Normandy. The plane, to me, is kind of a chameleon. It, I came out many times to take pictures of the plane and study the plane and look at the plane and looked at the plane on the internet and every picture I saw of the plane in different light, the plane is a different color. At times the plane is an olive green. It can go from an olive green to a dark forest green to a brown green like it is today, depending on the color of the overcast, the sun, all that of the sky. So I'm trying to combine all the colors that I've seen in the plane at different times into it in, this, in the color that I'm portraying it to be in the, in the mural. Um, like I said, it, it's different every time I look at it. And if I go out there later in the day and look at it, it'll be different again. And it's, it's really kind of cool the way it changes it with the light. Change. I am making it go through the clouds. So... kind of a, this is my kind of technique I devised that kind of looks like airbrushing, but it is. I thought it looked too, there's clouds all around it, and it kind of looked like it's just, you know, on top of them. And, I don't know, at least when I've flown, I you know, seem to go through clouds at one point or another. So I thought, well, add a little cloud formation here. It does. Where it naturally would kind of be. When I walked in the plane, you could almost feel like the, the people's presence still in the plane that had originally been in the plane. So that was pretty cool too. So the whole sense of history with this whole endeavor is it's like really cool to me and, and totally fascinating. And so I want to do the best possible look of this plane I can get.